At least 500 indigenous children died while attending Native American boarding schools backed by the U.S. government. That, from a first-of-its-kind federal study out just today, 500 dead children. According to the Interior Department report, federal officials identified more than 400 schools where teachers forced Native American students to assimilate into white society. They say they also found more than 50 burial sites at or near some of those schools, many graves not even marked. These schools operated across the country for more than 150 years, starting way back in the 1800s. Oftentimes, indigenous kids were taken from their own families, banned from speaking their native languages, and abused. Many kids never went back home. Interior Secretary Deb Holland is the first Native American to serve on the cabinet. She says her own grandparents were sent to boarding schools as children. In a statement, Secretary Holland wrote, recognizing the impacts of the federal Indian boarding school system cannot be just a historical reckoning. We must also chart a path forward to deal with these legacy issues.